He gave his life for his country. Today, his name was given to a building in his hometown. The Chester Post Office became the Lieutenant Lewis Allen Post Office during a dedication ceremony that honored the memory of a popular tuxedo science teacher who was killed while serving with his New York Army National Guard unit in Iraq in 2005. First Lieutenant Lou Allen was a model. Those who worked for the post office renaming say it'll provide a tangible reminder of Lou Allen's contribution to his country and community. And though five years has passed, Lou's sister Lorreen says the emptiness remains. This is a bittersweet moment for my family. I would do. Sorry. I would give anything I could to go back in time and have Lou in our lives, but there is no going back. We can only move forward from here. And in moving forward, it's important that Lou is never forgotten. Lou Allen left behind wife Barbara and four sons. She's writing a book about the circumstances surrounding his death. Despite a military jury's verdict, the family remains convinced that a fellow soldier was responsible for the mine explosion that killed Lou and Captain Philip Esposito. <laughs> But today was about good memories, and being at the post office brought one of them back for Barbara. And I can remember coming to this post office when Lou was a mailman here and hanging out with him, and I just think that he would be laugh. He would be honored and laughing and have something obnoxious to say about it too, but I think it's, a, it's very fitting. Would he have liked this? No, no, he would have been embarrassed. What the heck is all this? He, he, it's just, you know, even to the point he told his wife, maybe you should cremate me so mom and dad won't come to the cemetery every day, which we do. Make you feel good that there's a tribute like this oh, for your son? Unbelievable. I, I can't believe that this is happening. People will know him forever. You know, even when we're all gone, when the whole family is gone, people are going to know who Lewis Allen was. This plaque will have a permanent place inside the post office, ensuring that Lou's memory will live on. In Chester, Tracy Baxter, Record Online.